Community members in the city of Logansport are still trying to come to grips with the loss of Marine Corporal Humberto Sanchez. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I'm Amber Grigley. The 22 year old was one of the 13 service members killed in an attack in Kabul, Afghanistan. WRTV's Nicole Griffin shows us how his former teacher, classmate and employer are among those honoring his service to our country. It, it gets very personal when it's someone that you you know, and you've watched him grow up and it's a great sacrifice. And um, I'm very proud of him. Jane Williams recalls some of her earliest memories of Umberto Sanchez. I had him in school and I teach elementary school. So I remember a little six year old, big dark eyes, sweet, shy little boy who grew into a soccer player and a LHS student that she knew. And a class clown, for sure. He was always making everyone laugh. Williams is now the president of the Logansport Art Association. She joined members of the community, including one of his former classmates and military families, to design and paint this mural. It's located at McDonald's on West Market Street in Logansport, where Corporal Sanchez worked in high school. And we just started putting these um, images that we had behind the uniform together to kind of just remember our hero in all facets and honor his life and and maybe help the family and their hearts and and all of our hearts heal during this. They call the mural a work of heart, a way to show their support for their hometown hero, someone who sacrificed everything for his country. There were so many times before we were fully done with all the detail work or adding the words or uh, whatever it was that we were doing that we just all took a step back and we just cried a little bit because it was coming together so beautifully and we just wanted to honor him and, and his his legacy and, and all that he was here and all that he was overseas and, and all that he did for us in this community, but also what he did for our country. William says for her, creating the mural has been an important part of her healing process, and she wants his family to know the community is thinking of them and praying for them as they grieve this tragic loss. Our town comes together when, when there's times of need and I think we all just want to embrace this family and let them know you sacrifice a lot and we understand it. We're sorry about it. Working for you, Nicole Griffin, WRTV. Now, there are plans in place to paint additional murals, including at the Eastside McDonald's in Logansport. The community support in Logansport does not stop at the mural. Local company Priceless Banners and Apparel Store is honoring Corporal Sanchez by creating these yard signs. The owner says he's had so many people in the community reach out wanting yard signs and T-shirts, including Sanchez's family. The store will be open this week, Tuesday through Friday. Each sign is $20. 100% of sales will go to a scholarship fund honoring Sanchez at the Case Cass County Community Foundation.